Configuring OPC Enum This tutorial is created using Windows Server 2000. However, Windows 95, Windows 98, and Windows NT have a similar process. Let's find OPC Enum in the Applications list in the Distributive Com Configuration Properties window. Let's use the scroll bar and scroll down. Click on OPC Enum and then click Properties. The first tab is the General tab. We want to click in the drop down box next to Authentication Level and ensure that None is selected. Now, at the top, let's click the Location tab. In the Location tab, we want to ensure that Run Application on this computer is checked. Since OPC Enum is a program that scans your registry for a list of OPC servers on your computer. Therefore, OPC Enum needs to be able to run on the computer where it resides. Now, we can click on the Security tab. On the Security tab, we want to ensure that Use Default is selected for each of the options. Since we have already set our default configuration permissions, it will allow OPC Enum to use these permissions to run. Now, let's click on the Identity tab. On the Identity tab, select the user account that you want OPC Enum to run under. We recommend you choose the Interactive User. This can be one of the most important settings for OPC Enum in some cases. Your configuration might also show that System Account is selected. This means that OPC Enum is currently running as a Windows service. Once you're done, click Apply and then OK to save your settings. Remember, you should be able to set your OPC server up the exact same way. For support, FAQs, or more information, please visit support.softwaretoolbox.com